Hi, my name is Willie Bum Watson, and today we're playing Stalker Anomaly. This is a very popular game right now, so and it's free to play, so we're gonna play it. Uh, we are gonna start with this faction. You can choose out of nine factions uh, with a bunch of AIs, a bunch of stories. So we're probably gonna start with this. This is recommended for new players. I did try to play this game on another faction. I think it was either this one or that one, but it, I think it was actually this one. And it seemed a little bit difficult. I did not know what the heck I was doing. So if this is recommended for new players, I am definitely gonna choose that. We could choose our portrait. I think this one looks pretty nice. We can name ourselves. Let's do William Watson. So William Watson. And brief history of this uh, faction is because they uh, all have their own stories. Uh, loners or free stalkers that prefer to remain unaligned with the various factions operating in the zone. The vast majority of the zone's inhabitants belong to this unofficial brotherhood uh, choosing to live life without getting caught up to in someone else's ideals so this seems pretty good uh random location rookie village let's do that i'm not a puss so we're gonna go on medium there is easy medium and hard difficulty we're just gonna go on medium we can choose our loadout we start with the pda which is the map which is which you need batteries to operate um we could start with the mp5 or we could get a svt i um all of warsaw pack rifles is this a warsaw attachments pu special scope okay so it tells us what can go on there i think we can get a shotgun but i think we just go to the ump 45 i think that would be the best um gauge geiger counter um a geiger, geiger counter measures uh radioactive radiation it detects the emission of alpha particles we're again definitely need that radiation is a big part of this game rf receiver radio frequencies receiver is a smaller device with a high sensitive rf module used for basic communications we're gonna not take that i suppose points left oh points left points used oh so we could only take what points we have that is very interesting um okay i think we are good we got a good gun we just start this and start the story mode i'm not gonna mess around with any of the other settings because it's, it just makes the game a little harder for ourselves so let's start uh stalker anomaly 1.5.1 tip number 67 oh tip number 49 wearing a helmet affects your sprinting capabilities w wearing a helmet well i guess okay all right uh game save delete auto slave okay uh no active task cool so in a second here it should pop up telling us what we should who we should uh, find to talk to. Ooh. You go down here. Oh, this is a hole. All right. So, hello. Here we go. There you go. Uh, stalkers, I've got some interesting work lined up that you might want to look at. You interested in adventure, fame, cash? Come to my place and rookie village and we'll talk. Okay, so Sid. We have to go find Sid. Are you Sid? Привет, брат. Uh, no, you are free stalkers, fanatic free stalkers. So we have to go find Sid. That's why I did my last time I played. Well, the first time I played, uh, I'm still brand new to this game. I just, I only played like 30 minutes of this game. So I still don't know what the heck I'm doing, but, um, hi. Uh, you are probably not Sid. Uh, the, the faction leaders are usually inside of a building. Um, factions fight each other. AIs fight each other. There are wars. There are battles. There are monsters. There's a bunch of stuff in this game. It's basically a uh, Metro. If you ever play the Metro games like Metro Exodus, it's like sort of like that game, but in like a different country. It's just similar, sort of, from what I could tell so far. Do I have my gun? I do have my gun. Um. 
first things first, let's put our PDA, our map, to a slot so we could use it. If you don't put it in a slot, you cannot use it. So, H. There we go. Boom. Where the heck are we? We are. Is this me? Um. Oh, there you go. Uh, that is me right there. So bad. Uh, important character to our right. Oh, that's an important character right here. No, All right, yet. Mr. Important Character. Okay. Hey, I don't think we I've seen you around here before. You seem pretty new, too. Uh, I'm the new deputy leader in, of this village, along with Wolf. I like to... Uh, if you'd like, I could teach you some things about the zone survival. Make sure you don't you won't die to the first mutant or anomaly you encounter. You know, I could actually use a little help. I'm ready to learn. Okay, excellent. Uh, first, let's teach you how to hunt mutants. There are some, there's a small herd of boars on the other side of the road nearby. Now, boars have thick skulls and tiny brains. So the best way to deal with them is shoot them inside or in a perfect world right up the bottom. I like it. First, uh, from a nice safe distance, we'll take them out together, but try to keep them off me. They, they're in heat this time of year. All right, new mission, training day, boar hunting. Oh, I'll just go boar hunting. Why not? Instead of doing the, uh, finding the main guy. Remember, Sid, we have to go find Sid. Uh, uh, item received, item received, we got rounds. Uh, okay, see you later. Um, oh, he's following me. Uh, <laughs> okay, training day, more hunting. Fanatic uh, seems to be the be one to one of the more experienced stalkers in the village that decided to teach me a trick or two. Okay, so which way is it? This way, I think, right? Let me open up my map. Let's see if it's actually... Um, is it here? Oh, right here. Training day, uh, boar hunting. I can't seem to actually like waypoint stuff but i think it's okay that way let's go we're on thing it's uh pretty good to know that you could actually have companions in this game that are actually also ai that's pretty cool as well are we coming up close to oh yes we are uh make sure we have our gun out we should be very close to the four. I mean, this actually gets us a little training. I am. Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh my gosh! I'm dead. I need another shot. Just need another shot. Just need another shot. I got up. Where did they come from? Where the heck did they come from? Um, last save. I have to remember, you have to save a lot in this game. I, 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 <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh, Fanatic's uh, the name. Uh, that's what they call me. I'm basically Wolf's Oh, I already read that, I think. Um, okay, let's just get the heck. Attempt number two. Uh, let's uh, let's save right now. Uh, quick save. <laughs> so what I also learned is that the blue line on the bottom left is your health, and the top left is your mini map. Oh my god, that is an anomaly. Um, that is radiation. I hear. Oh gosh, I never put my PDA on my thing so i could actually read it all right so we are coming up on the board right now so uh maybe putting the game to difficulty oh my gosh i shot my gun Sketch blood, sketch <laughs> ah! i dropped my gun <laughs> I can't, I can't. 
god. <laughs> Does he always die? Um. So is G dropping stuff? It is. Okay, I did go change that. Uh, one big thing about this game is that you have to use, all the keybinds are messed up, man. Messed up. So where the heck is the weapons drop item? That no, that should be a forbidden thing, like forbidden. Now I have to go find. Can I? Got these things? Need a knife. Uh, I have a knife. Need a stronger knife for this mutant. Yeah, I'm going to my last save. Yeah, uh, we're going to do that. Because, number one, I dropped my gun somewhere that I don't know of. Um, and I, I want to go see if I can actually save him. And now we actually have a bigger gun so we can kill the animals faster. I think. We still have to watch out for the anomaly. So your companions could really die really easily. Oh, uh, that is not good right there. That's an anomaly. Um, I, yeah. Okay, we're coming up on the boars once again. Oh, there we go. Nice. Training day. Speak to fanatic. Um, hi. How you doing? Dude, that was crazy. What now? Well done. See if your knife's strong enough to get a few parts off them. Well, when you're done, let's head to the nearest anomalous zone. Um, uh, my knife is definitely not strong enough. My, my knife is not strong enough. What's up? Um, a knife is not strong enough. I don't have a strong knife. Uh, let's see about the inventory now. So I need a better knife. Unsuitable for chopping thick, thick skin mutants. Okay. Cool. Um. So train day reached the anomalous area. Fanatica seems to be one of the more experienced. experienced uh reach the anomalous area um hold on what in the heck don't worry you you are one crazy son of a gun um what the actual heck Are they dead? Need a knife. Chop body. Um, nice. You did. You, 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 we are doing, we are doing quite well. We are doing quite well. So you have to go back. I don't see that on the map, man. Actually, I'm a liar. Uh, it was just camouflaged with the, the map. Okay. So you have to go this way, right? I can't really see myself that well. I have to remember that these use batteries. So next area. Oh, this. Can I do this? Oh, loot selected. Loot. Loot all? We get me. Okay, I didn't even kill this thing, but you got me. Nice. Um, hi, how's it going? Oh, we got you got some more. Oh wow, that's a lot of stuff. Well, thank you for killing whatever is here for me. Thank you very much. Uh, this as well. Um, can I crouch and? No, I can't loot that. Hi. Well, we're going back up here. You, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, you got lucky. Uh, trash compactor anomaly. Trash compactor. <laughs> Hold up. Wait a minute. I. 
I'm keeping my eyes wide open. This box. Um, I am taking whatever is inside this box. What about this? Can I loot that? That looks like a box. That looks like a box. Um. What do we do with that? No? Okay. What about up here? This is where we're supposed to be. Training day, speak to fanatic. Um. Uh, here we go. What do I need to do now? Uh, so this pit is full of gravitational anomalies. See the, that artifact over there? That's just a loaf of anomalous bread. Ignore it, but also in this pit is a jellyfish. And jellyfishes, along with every other artifact, have both positive and negative qualities. It's quite unfortunate. Uh, it's quite fortunate that one is here now. Here now, let's uh, talk about the equipment you should have for artifact hunting. Uh, get the jelly jellyfish artifact. Show me. Okay, here. Uh, oh, echo detector. Uh, here, an echo, echo detector. All detectors, while active, register the presence of artifacts and measure the distance to the nearest one. They're, they are a basic requirement for finding any artifact that isn't just junk. When you when you hear it uh, beeping, then you know you're know an artifact must be nearby. The more frequent the beeps, the closer the artifact. Unfortunately, this old model can't detect all types of artifacts, but it should be just fine for your attempt today. Better models have better detection range and abilities. Not bad. Oh my gosh. Lead line metal container. Now this second tool, a lead container. Do you still remember the talk about artifacts and their positive and negative qualities? Just about every artifact worth carrying is radioactive these days. The lead container can completely seal the artifact inside, keeping you safe from its radiation but also prevents you from using its other effects until removed. Without it, your ass would begin glowing and you'd die in less than a few hours of carrying even a single artifact. It's quite heavy, but it's better safe than sorry. If you actually want to use an artifact on yourself, it's best done with a more advanced container. Scientists call them artifact application modules, which will protect you from the rads without blogging its other qualities all these Sid sells all of this from time to time but he usually saves the AA, AAMs for the more experienced stalkers good to know this container sure is heavier right what's next uh good to know uh item received vodka uh next is it is this model of Nirmov like I said almost all all, all all artifacts are radioactive these days and even if you brought a lead container, the anomaly field itself is still going to give you a little glow. This bottle will help you uh, pass some of that glow out of your system. Great. Anything else? Bot bolts. Oh, why? I have some bolts. You actually had some bolts on you when you died that one time. <laughs> oh, yes. Bolts. Never forget about these uh, before jumping inside anomalous anomalous fields uh, throw them around to find your way through the, the surrounding anomalies that's all let's go i'll cover you from here on uh, is there any work you want done oh peace so you want me to go down there now oh hi is he going back so you want me what? So why do you want me to grab one of these now? I... Trash compactor. Okay, well, let's let's get one of these things then. Uh... <laughs> get the jellyfish artifact. Uh, well, there goes half my health. Over half my health. I'm one well, person that button. Um... <laughs> I am scared. Uh, so we need a lead container, empty. Um, details, okay. 
so we're gonna go back okay so we're actually gonna do this in the next video because my time has run out for this video leave a like and a comment if you want more uh surrender ass so we know who you are wounded what the heck okay that's interesting um is he around? I am. Is he around me? Okay, listen. I'm fine. <laughs> Comment down below if you want more Stalker Anomaly. This game has 200 plus 200 mods installed from the other games, which is kind of crazy. Um, if you want to know how to install this, comment down below. I can make a video about that, how to install this game. But if you want more of this game, comment down below too. Uh, leaving a like and a comment helps me go on YouTube's recommended page, so more people see this video. So do that and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.